He hails from San Francisco, and um, his parents are Japanese. And uh, so was he. <laughs> Oddly enough. Ladies and gentlemen, Pat Morita. Wow, oh, these lights, they, they make my eyes squint. <laughs> oh, look, uh, don't misunderstand me. Uh, uh, I'm of Japanese extraction, but I was born and raised around San Francisco. And uh, that just goes to prove that we weren't all made in Japan. <laughs> look, look I, I know a lot about Japan. Uh, I've never been there before. It just happened to look like the rest of them. <laughs> but uh, I do. I know a lot about Japan. I mean, after all, my, my folks are from, from the old country. And I have friends that go back and forth all the time. And they're always telling me a lot of great stories about this beautiful country. And uh, I've heard so many stories about how really great the uh, Japanese woman is as a wife. I went out, I married one. And, uh, yeah, and she's from the old country, you know, schooled in the oldest traditions of subservience to the husband. And uh, I'll never forget the, the first time I met her. I went up to her, I said, um, do you drink? She said, hi. I said, would you like a little nip? <laughs> and uh, I never, I'll never forget the way, uh, the first time I heard her, the way she spoke. I mean, uh, most people think that French is the sexiest language in the world. I disagree. I think it's Japanese. Japanese is the only language I ever heard of where before they even say anything, they go, oh. <laughs> I remember how in the beginning when I first met her, you know, she used to bow in the traditional manner, go around with her little assholes. Aso, aso. We got married, I found out she couldn't sew anything. <laughs> And that was a time when she used to bring me my slippers, you know, and cook a little sukiyaki in front of me, bring my favorite cup of sake, cutty sake. <laughs> and that was a time, that was a time when she was always so quiet, you know, so shy, obedient. Everything I ever asked her to do was always, hi, 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 hi. Now, Miss Karate Mouth of 1965. <laughs> she talks like, like you wouldn't believe it and argue, listen, wow. This geisha chick, she argues like, like an ex-kamikaze fighter, to the death. <laughs> Listen, you got a better chance speaking Yiddish to an Arab. <laughs> and no matter what she says, it always comes out the same. Give me, get me, buy me, do me, I want, I want. <laughs> I thought I finally had her satisfied once. Bought her a mink kimono. Now she wants an American gardener. <laughs> No, but seriously, you know, there, there is one great thing about having a Japanese wife, and that is that your mother-in-law lives in Tokyo. <laughs> Last year, my wife became a baseball nut uh, because, well, she found out that the San Francisco Giants had hired three Japanese guys for the team, and I wondered what it was like, you know, spring training last year. I figured it might have gone something like this. Alvin Dark, who was then manager of the Giants, he probably had to make the kids feel at ease, you know. And so he probably got them together and probably spoke to them, maybe a little bit something like this. Okay, now, fellas, I just want you to be yourselves. You play your hearts out for us like you did back in the old country, and everything's just going to be great. Now, I tell you what I do want you to do right now, boys. I want you to listen to a couple of our stars. Now, these fellas make lots of money, and they can help you. First baseman Orlando Cepeda here makes over $50,000 a year. Now, y'all listen to what he's got to say. Orlando, you come on over here and say something to the Japanese boy. Oh, sure, Skipper. <laughs> I think is a good thing, a, cha -cha -cha, a Japanese boy, <laughs> come and help us and teach us how he and run and throw the ball slanty. <laughs> but uh, I don't like to talk English language too good, so you guys say, uh, you listen to Willie Mays, eh? Because uh, he make over $100,000 a year, this guy. Hey, Willie, you come say something to Japanese kid. Oh, yeah, baby, don't, don't be crazy again. <laughs> Look at him, man. I wouldn't jive. You know where you know that. And, of course, with this, the spokesman of the Japanese group, he's got to stand up, speak for himself, right? So he stood up and said, Oh, Willie Mays, uh, Orando Cepeda, Arvindaku, 
how come you three guys make a nearly quarter million dollar a year, but you don't know how to talk American like us? <laughs> Wonderful. Wonderful.